Welcome to Sash Club Wrestling. Happy 50,000 subscribers. My name is John. My name is Dante. Today, we are doing an honor of WrestleMania being tonight. If you're watching this on the day it comes out, WrestleMania night one is tonight. So we are doing the Cody Rhodes quiz. Let's go. Yes, that is right. You heard it here first. The American Nightmare quiz. What's on the line today? The SCW Championship's going to be on the line, just like the Undisputed WWE mm -hmm. Universal Championship will be on the line tomorrow night. We'll see if the American Nightmare Cody Rhodes will walk out at champ, and we'll see if I walk out as champ today. I don't know, but first things first, let's see what Sophie has to say about that email. Sophie, can you read us the email, please? Absolutely. Hey, John, Dante, and Sophie. Love the channel, especially the quizzes. Good luck mm. and have fun. Kevin from Carolina. Shout out. Kevin from Carolina. Kevin Carolina, because that could have been Kevin from anywhere else, any other state. From <laughs> Federline. Federline, yep. Dante, let's crack open a couple ginger ales, let's brother. Do it. In honor. Oh. oh the why they both right. go everywhere? Yeah, I don't know. <laughs> right. Cheers. Mm. Cheers. Dante, we're going to get started. Good luck. Good luck, sir. Boom. Number one, Cody made his main roster debut on July 16th of 2007 against who? Good question. Wow. I'm oddly confident in this. This feels like one that we, hmm. We may have mm. answered this on, this may have been a question on another quiz. I th I'm oddly confident in this. All right, this could be, or very wrong. Three, two, one. Randy Orton. Randy Orton. Correct. Yeah, we definitely yeah, had it I in think, a quiz. I think yeah, that was, yeah little Slumdog else. Millionaire moment. <laughs> Never seen it. <laughs> oh my god. That's on my list. It's on my Good. watch list on Letterboxd. Says he's a movie guy. <laughs> <laughs> I'm, I'm new to movies. I'm becoming new, one. I'm becoming new to one. movies. I've never so seen funny. one before <laughs> last. New to I movies. Like that. So funny. Creed three was the first movie I watched in my life. <laughs> like these are cool. I skipped over the first. Wow. Are they all like this? Are they all, <laughs> are they all boxing movies? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> all right. It's just Michael B. Jordan. No. That's it. Every every. You watch a second see movie, movie, you're like. Where, Where was he? <laughs> Fuck. I watched like The Godfather. Yeah, there's Michael. There's <laughs> there's no boxing in this. This is stupid. All right, number two. Number two. Cody won his first championship on the 15th anniversary episode of Raw. Who did he tag with to win the belts? Bonus question if you can name the team they beat. Or bonus oh. Oh. point. I know who he was with. Um, what was the year? Uh, the 15th anniversary episode. I think it was episode. like 2007. Or, it was like. 2006, okay. 2007, yeah, I'm something not like sure. that ballpark. Oh, I know who was. Was it? I know who his partner was. Who did they beat on Raw? Though I'm thinking of SmackDown teams. I have no idea. I I gave a. These people have never been shouted out on this channel or any channel before. So, <laughs> three to one. It's Hardcore Holly, and I think Lance K and Trevor Murdoch. Wow. I, uh, I put Kofi and I put uh, London Kendrick. It is Hardcore Holly, and they did beat Lance No Kaden. way. Oh, That's an incredible really? guess. Genuine yeah. guess. They did win. I'm, I wasn't, they, they had the tight tag titles, right? Didn't Kofi and Kofi and Cody have the titles? Not, Who am I thinking of? Kofi and CM Punk had the titles at one point. Maybe that's what I'm thinking Evan of. Evan Bourne, maybe? Oh, maybe Evan Bourne. Yeah. Hmm, is that damn. One bonus point? Yeah. So, okay, so I get two there. Wow, I, that was a that's genuine. A, that is a. Pulled that out of my ass. Educated guess if I've ever seen one. Wow. I'm on a roll today. <laughs> two questions mm -hmm. and I'm on a roll. <laughs> <laughs> Number three. Three at the 2008 Night of Champions, Cody would turn on Holly to form a new tag team with this man. Damn, you know your yeah, early Jesus Cody stuff. You know your early like 2007. Cody this is like when I was into wrestling. Like I just, start, I think I first started wrestling in 06. First started. Wrestling. I first started wrestling in 06. Started watching it. So this was kind of my my wheelhouse. See, I like only watched SmackDown as a kid, mm -hmm. so I didn't get too many like Raw. I'm a SmackDown guy. Yeah, and I'm a SmackDown guy. Ah, this is no way. This is right. Three, two, one. Ted DBS. Oh, junior. but Ted. Ted's yeah. nice, go, nice, nice. I didn't. I thought. It, I didn't think it was gonna be that early. Yeah, crazy moment. I remember. Wow. Why, I think I were they already in. Was Legacy already a no, thing? That was okay, before. okay. I think that was like. But then they that's joined. When they got they joined together, Legacy together, as a together, team. Yes. Okay, okay, okay. That's so. That's where I was shaky. Yep. You know. Hey, we got it. Cody and Ted were members of a four-person stable called Legacy. <laughs> Name the two other members. Oh fuck. Oh well. Two others. Oh, what was his name? Um, I thought it was just the three. Oh my gosh. Was it like a short-lived fourth? Yeah. What the fuck? fuck? What was his name? I know who he is, but I can't think of his name. Um, wow. Oh, actually. Oh fuck. Ugh. It's not point per. It's just just overall. Just yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. All right. So, but that being said, I'm both are nothing. I'm gonna go crazy. Oh, both are nothing. That's what oh. I assume. Yeah, I didn't even. Yeah. You're going crazy? What Fuck, are you doing? What was the guy's <laughs> name? Um, you got it? No. no? I'm um, I, I didn't remember there was a fourth one. I don't know. I got to guess. All right. Three, two, one. 
I can't think of his name. It was uh, remember Deuce Deuce and Domino. Oh he yeah. He was in it, and I put Randy Orton. Uh, Randy, and I put Davy Boy Smith Jr. It's Randy and Ma- Manu. 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 Is that his name? No, I don't. No, I don't think so. Manu. That sounds uh, I'm familiar. Look it yeah, up. look up. He's a um. He's like part of like. Oh, that know. sounds familiar. I have his like. I can see his long hair and everything like that. I can see his his attire. Yeah. Uh, oh my God. I had Afa written down oh. and I, uh, I erased it. Oh, he's in a Noe. A Noe. I yeah, know why. He's, uh, he's related to Roman. I don't know what the relation is. Wait, can you. He's search? From, oh, from Hamden, Connecticut. Why Look not? up his name and search Legacy. I just want to see him with Legacy. He wow. wasn't like they turned wow. on him. Damn. That wow. sucks. I had. So wow. I wouldn't have gotten it because I had uh, him and Afa. So I wouldn't have had Orton, but he'll be the new med- member of the bloodline after Mania. <laughs> where, yeah, where was he doing? <laughs> he hasn't been around. Wow. He's like 16 years. Number five. In 2010, Cody would debut a new gimmick where he would give out fashion tips to the crowd. What was his nickname during the time? During what year? 2010. Yeah. Am I overthinking this? I'm not overthinking this. Three to one. Dashing? Dashing. Correct. Yeah. So when he had the mustache, right? Yes, sir. Yes. Good look. Good look. Honestly, he, he, great he look. He rocked the mustache. He could be part of some club that... Hey, Cody. <laughs> Our line's open. I would. <laughs> the love, door's always open. He should absolutely bring the stash back. That would be great. Like with, with the, the blonde, blonde hair. hair now, he <laughs> would look fantastic. That, that would look. That would oh, look so, Cody. Love it. Cody, come Listen, on. Hear us out, Cody. Hear us out. Would be a good look. Oh. In 2011, focus on 2011. Mm-hmm. Got it. In 2011, Cody would win his first ever singles title in the WWE. What title was it? And bonus points if you can name who he beat. This is one of those time periods where, like, that belt was just being... Um... Oh, wait a minute. All right, so obviously I see your U.S. Why do I put... I put... Why did I... <laughs> Universal champion? Yeah, sure. <laughs> Universal Champion. Um, fuck. Um, yeah, it was... this is going to be, like, an educated guess. I have no idea. 3 to 1. I see title Rey Mysterio. I see title Rey Mysterio. I see title, and he beat Ezekiel Jackson. Ooh. Yeah, so it's someone random, you know what I mean? Yeah. Do we get one point for that, or is that a uh, all yeah. or nothing? Yes. Let's go. Let's go. Alrighty, number seven. In 2012, Cody would form a tag team called Road Scholars with this man. What year? 2012. <laughs> <laughs> 2002. <laughs> this is like, the, the, these years Road in Scholars. My, in my... Oh, well, is it just... No, but... It, wait a minute. But that... Scholars sounds like a. Hmm. I'm not gonna over going it. back and forth with the coffee and ginger ale. I'm grossing oh, myself. That's oh, just, that's a weird oh, mix. Stop. You shouldn't maybe. have put the ginger ale in front of me. I can't uh, help it. Three to one. Damien Sandow. Oh, I just put gold dust. Damien Sandow is correct. Uh, the roads tripped me up because then I was thinking like, okay, well, it's gotta be a rose. All right, fill in the blank. One point per. Oh, it's like Ooh. a Mad Lib. Um, oh, <laughs> shit. No, first time doing. One I of love those. Mad Libs. <laughs> I mean, okay, maybe not really. In 2013, Cody would team with his real-life brother, Blank, to defeat Blank to win the WWE Tag Team titles. Okay, we need an adjective. We need a noun. <laughs> I didn't uh, hear the rest of it. Can you reread it again, please? Yeah, just the whole thing? Yeah. Um, <laughs> Damn, I don't know. You know who they, who they beat? Holy yeah. shit. It's a pretty, it was a pretty big moment mm. at, at the time. 2012, you say. Or what was it? Would you say 2012? I don't know. 2013. God damn. I was going to say I'm off. Oh, uh, mm-mm, no. Mm-mm, no. I got nothing. I got nothing. I'm going to go 3 2 1. Gold Dust and they beat the Shield. Oh, Gold Dust the Shield. No yeah, way. That's yeah, it. Seth you and got Roman. it. Let's yeah. go. Two points to his bonus, right? Um. Yes. Yep. What? Yeah. Two okay. points. Yeah. See, I, I was trying to, I knew like like 2013, that was Shield era, but I didn't know who they lost to. Yeah, but I figured I, they must have won. The lost big sometime. show came out through the crowd and like knocked out one of them. Mm. And like it was, uh, yeah, it was a big nice. thing. Good shit. Good Beautiful. Pull. Good pull. All right. Nine six. All right. This nine is six. close. This is good. In 2014, Cody would don a face paint and go by this cosmic name. Don face paint is such an like, interesting way to say, like, would wear. <laughs> he donned face paint. Yeah. Three to one. Stardust. Stardust. Correct. Let's go. Oh, what if he comes out in Mania in face paint? He's not gonna, but what if? I would love what if, if like, one episode. Or a mask like, or something. Like a house shit. show or something like that. That would, be, that would yeah. be cool. That or, like, washes it off be. after yeah, before or whatever. That would be funny. Uh, true or false? I like this quiz. There's a lot of variations. There's this a lot, is like a really this, good quiz. Yeah. yeah. Um, Shout out to Carolina. It seems like it's going yeah. chronologically too. If I'm not yeah. mistaken. Yeah. I agree oh yeah. It, it might just be. so far all W. Obviously all WWE. Mm-hmm. But all right, number ten. True or false? During his indie run, Cody would go to go on to win the TNA Impact Wrestling Heavyweight Championship. 
True or false? Oh. <laughs> and? <laughs> I forgot. Against who? <laughs> oh, fuck. Um, I have no idea. I have no clue. Because he did a stint in he DNA did. for sure. I don't sure. know how long he was there for. Um, hmm. I'm going to go one of these answers. I, you I'm, know what? I'm going to go with true or false. I'm going to. Three, two, one. False? I also put false. False is correct. Okay. Yeah. All right. I didn't think so. 11, 8. Yeah, this is close. We're keeping up No, this here. is We're, good. Psh. This is a good question. Are you? Did you get one wrong yet? I'm, I think I, I think so. Mm-hmm. Yeah. I must have. I'm just fiending for a sweep city. Number 11. In 2019, Cody would start All Elite Wrestling with these three people, also serving as executive presidents alongside Cody. One point per. Okay. okay. Can do so. Thank you. Three to one. Nick and Matt Jackson and Kenny Omega. I agree with that. Nick, Matt Jackson. Yeah, Kenny Omega. Huge. You did it. Why wouldn't they just put, have us put the, the elite? <laughs> yeah. yeah. I would have accepted it. If I was going to. I was going to say. I was gonna, like, like Young Bucks or whatever. We, we both knew. All right. 1411. Number 12. At the first ever AEW event, Cody would have a match with this man that would later go on to be named PW Insider Match of the Year. There is two people I have in mind, and they both could be wrong. <laughs> Good. <laughs> um, Whoa. Ugh. Oh, because man. one of them definitely could have been matched with the other guy. Like, I don't know. He's a good wrestler, but I don't know. The match of the year is throwing me off. I wish it said, because, like, oh. they had, like, one event before it was right. AEW. Exactly. Or you know what I mean? Mm-hmm. You know, I'm going to roll with the weird one. The match of the year is really that's throwing me that's off. That's throwing me off. I don't think, I never would have tied this guy to a match of the year, but fuck it. Why not? Three, two, one. I said Scorpio Sky. Is it Kenny Omega? It is Dustin Rhodes, Gold Ooh, Dust. Oh, yeah. Yeah. I don't know why I was thinking Scorpio. I was thinking Scorpio or Sammy Guevara. Those were the two I was choosing. Damn, I forgot oh, about that, man. man. I, I didn't I know that was the first one. I thought that was later on. Yeah, I'm going to look up later what on. that event hmm. was. I think they might have wrestled more than once. Double or nothing 2019. Yeah, I guess. I believe is what it was. It was you great. know what? Now that I'm now I'm looking at this, it does sound familiar. Because they were bloody yeah. up. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Wow. It was a great match. Ah, oh, fuck. Damn. I thought it was something before Damn that. It. I wasn't. Yeah, me uh, too. Not that I would have came up with that anyways. But. All right. Alrighty, 13. At Double or Nothing 2020, Cody would become the first ever TNT champion by beating this man. Oh, God. <laughs> Shit. Again, there's two people I have in mind. I do you have someone written down. Yeah, I don't think it's right. I think it's a uh, good, it's a solid guess, but I don't think it's right. Three, two, one. Sammy. Darby Allen. Lance Archer. Oh, that's it Darby was, was the other guy I was yeah. thinking of too. Lance Archer. That sound, yep, that sounds right. That sounds yeah, right. Yeah, that does sound right. Oh, man. Sounds right because it's right. I wouldn't have pulled that out. I would not have pulled that no, out. But that's a, that, I yep. forgot about that. In January of 2022, Cody would wrestle his last match in AEW against this man in a ladder match for the TNT title. I don't know how to, I don't know how to spell his last yeah, name. Yeah, that's all right. Three to one. Sammy Guevara. Sammy Guevara. Correct. <laughs> I love at the beginning of his song, Sammy Guevara. <laughs> That's what it says? Yeah, he goes, Sammy Guevara. And then at the, I think Ty Mellows now goes, Ty Mello. <laughs> I don't know how many points I, I had. Three. I erased it. I think I have 12 now. Yeah, I had okay. three. Yeah, yeah. Is this Wager? Uh, wager? No. no, it's not. No. How many questions are there? Uh, there's, there's, there's 16. Oh, yeah. But um, okay. this is the last regular one. Cool. 15. Cody would return to WWE at WrestleMania 38 to be a surprise opponent for this man. Hmm. Okay. Hmm. Internet superstar. <laughs> Logan Paul. <laughs> Three to one. Seth Rollins. Seth. Correct. Let's go. All right. Good stuff. Big. Big one. 16 to 13. Wow. And we got a wage around here. What if it's like, who is Cody facing at this year's WrestleMania? Okay, so like, we're going in order here. The, if I had to guess, this is me, this is me game planning. I'll bet you, I'll bet you, well, I don't know. It could be a swerve. You've done well this quiz. You're a Cody Rose. I've done well for the WWE related questions. Everything after that, I haven't been that well. So it really depends on yeah. what he's, the swerve. I'm probably going to wager too low, but I got my wager. Yeah, I'm about to have my wager too. I just want to... Wager change? Slightly. Whoa. Slightly? What does that mean? How do you change a number slightly? <laughs> you, you, you'll see. You'll see. <laughs> All, All right. right. I got my wager, I right. think. All right. So if you read us that last question. After tearing his peck, Cody would return to win the 2023 Royal Rumble match by last eliminating this man. So we oh, we watched this on the last stream. We watched it. Oh, who I remember. Oh, I didn't know if he was going to swear or some not. He kept kept consistent with the uh, chronological order. Because I remember one. watching this and we're like, I remember we were like, this is a good final four. 
I'm between two. Damn. No. Okay. I'm back to one, but I don't think it was this person. <sighs> Who the fuck was it? Who was it? We won. Oh, you, had, you had way sucks. too many. You had way too many PBRs that too night. Too many. Too many Miller Islands. This was the first match of the night. You were hammered by the end of it. Is it obvious? I don't remember. <sighs> I don't think it's this person. I'm coming. You're gonna say it, and I'm gonna I'm gonna lose my mind. I'm afraid. I don't want you to lose your mind. I hope you pulled it out. I really do. Cause you're gonna be mad. I... You're stressing me out. Who did he eliminate? I gotta lock in. I gotta lock in. All right. Well, John, it was a pleasure, like always. Dante, I, good luck. I wish you the best of luck. It's gonna, it's gonna come flying back to me the second you say it. I'm gonna be like, yeah, because it's not who I put. It's not who I wrote down for the SCW championship. We'll see you tonight at the watch party. Three to one. It was Gunther. Oh, what? I put, oh, because they had the, like, they had like a 20 minute match after I put Drew. I couldn't remember. I, cause they, yeah, yeah. Cause they had like a 10, 10 to 15 minute match after Gunther. Yeah. Oh, it was Gunther. So my wager, I wagered almost all my points. So I was going to go all in initially, but. See, my strategy, I think, moving forward with wagers is I want to give myself... So, like, I had 16, I wagered 15. Because I want to at least have one point at the end to prove that I at least <laughs> sure, did something. Yeah, yeah, you know yeah. what I mean? So I don't finish with zero. There's 31, silly reign defending Gone the CW champion. Dante. I'm so disappointed. The second you turn it over, yeah. I was like... I was like, yep, they fought for 20 minutes. We were so excited. Yeah. We thought Gunther might win. Yep. Yeah. Hey, sometimes it slips your mind. Oh, my it's God. Your mind. That's Again, a Rhodes quiz. we'll see you tonight for the WrestleMania watch party. Night one is tonight right here on the Ooh. YouTube channel. I'm very excited. It's going to be a good, good time. Other than that, you can follow me at Raspy Taylor on Twitter, Instagram, YouTube, Spotify, Twitch. Twitch. Twitch new now. one. Twitch now. And you can follow me on Twitter at Dante Deck or Dante Toro slash Dante 11 everywhere else. John, it's as always a pleasure. One, one more for the road. One for the road. The road. I'll see you. I'll see you later on tonight hey. on that couch. That couch. Me and you later. <laughs> oh. And then, okay. All right. Uh, all right. <laughs> what an ending.